Right out of the box, your system will be set up to monitor 24-7 and to start recording when some sort of motion is detected. But if you'd rather set up the system to record at a specific time, regardless of motion, then you would come to the Schedule icon. To demonstrate, I'm going to assume that on my system, up here in the channel box, I'll tell the system I would like Channel 1 to record at a specific time. And down here in the Apply Settings 2 box, I'm only going to apply this schedule to Channel 1. Now I go up here to check the box and click on it to highlight it. By clicking in these timeline boxes, I'm going to schedule the system to record Channel 1 every morning from 4 a.m. to 8 a.m. I hit Apply, and boom, we're done. But wait, now that I think about it, it would be good to apply that same schedule to the camera on Channel 3. I go down here, change the Apply Settings to Camera 3, and hit the Copy button. Then hit Apply, and now Camera 3 has the same schedule. The same process is used in the motion boxes. The system default is set to always record motion, but let's say that there's some motion in a shot that always occurs at 8 o'clock, and I just really don't want that to record every day. I go up here and click on the Erase box, which is the right-hand button, and let's say that motion always happens on the camera that's on Channel 4. So I select 4 in the Channel box, and I'm only going to apply it to Channel 4 in the Apply Settings 2 box. Now I erase the blue out of the 8 a.m. slot, and the camera will not activate with motion from 8 to 9. Copying to other cameras works just the same way we talked about in the schedule section. For this sensor tab, if you have some type of alarm sensor, say door or window sensor, and again, you know someone's going to open that door every morning at 8 a.m., follow the same instructions that we just talked about for motion. 